deep in the middle of the field. Torrey Smith. And Torrey Smith is in for an Eagles touchdown. Other times, he has really earned the respect of his teammates with that top. Just going for a deep ball. Has a man behind the defense. It's caught for a touchdown. The rookie, Mac Collins, with his first career touchdown. 64 yards. Tough. The man just gets smashed. And he gets up the next play and throws a bomb for a touchdown. He did it against the Chargers. He did it against the Panthers. And he does it again in the Washington Redskins on a beautiful double move against D.J. Swearer. Third down, Wentz throws, pass, caught, end zone. Burton, touchdown. That he had and where he had to put it to give Burton an opportunity to make this play because Mark Barron, he's there to where he can try to fall off of his receiver and make a play on it as well. If you drive it down low, if you keep it up high and Wentz lost it. Touchdown to Trey Burton. Carson Wentz with a strike. Three for Wentz in the first half. Well, he gets the mismatch he wanted. Tight end on the linebacker, Marshall. Check out possession here. This is real close. From the nine yard line. Wentz stays on his feet, gets it off, and it's a touchdown. Corey Clement, the rookie out of Wisconsin. And now they throw it for a touchdown against the Redskins. And how about that pocket toughness? How does he get away from all these free rushers and make throws like that? Went 7 out of 10 against the Blitz. They're lined up as if they're coming after him, and they do. And he's in trouble. Wentz will be escaping from the 18-yard line. How in the world did that happen? First down out to the 44-yard line. Was he down? Where did he go? Amazing. He came out of a pile of bodies. And he's not down. Nope. Pass over the middle. It is caught for the touchdown. That's Trey Burton. Boy, he was well covered, and Carson Wentz just threw a beautiful pass for the touchdown. They have the perfect route called as the defender there jumps to the outside. John Johnson, Ogletree trying to get underneath it. He's able, never able to even get turned around to see if the ball is in flight. And Carson. Aaron Sproles in the backfield, third down and 12. Wentz, and five and one, spins away, under pressure. Still on his feet. Now he fires downfield and it's caught by Nelson Aguilar for an Eagles touchdown. 58 yards. It started to collapse. And this is what you get when you have Carson Wentz. We saw this in the preseason. We saw this at times last season. And it's so hard on a defense to stick with the receiver this long. Nelson Aguilar catches the pop. The fly ball and makes one guy miss touchdown Eagles. Quick start for three receivers all set to the left side. Play clock at one. They blitz. Went steps up, avoids it, throws to the end zone. Caught. Aguilar for the touchdown. Over Maxwell again to make it a one possession game. <laughs> well, that was all pretty good, wasn't it? Those two throws, escaping the pressure, keeping his eyes up the field, and finding a little space down the field for Aguilar. Only a three-man rush this time. The pressure put on Wentz. They almost get him from behind. Slings it deep down field, and it's caught by Aguilar. And Aguilar into 
Seattle territory. So Wentz on a three man rush under pressure from Quentin Jefferson. But a 51 yard gain. This is unbelievable. Watch this throw falling down, getting tackled, and gets it about 45 yards down the field. I don't think that Byron Maxwell thought he could throw it that.